What's up guys and welcome back to the Rob Squad. So today I've got something really special planned for you guys. Um, I love photography. I've dabbled a little bit with our family. I love doing nature photography. So I'm really excited to do some baby Christmas photos with baby Luca. We're gonna do some DIY baby Christmas photos. I've got three ideas for you guys. They're super easy, super simple, super cheap. Before we get into that, make sure you are subscribed to this channel, your notification bell is turned on, and you liked this video. Give us a thumbs up, help us out. Okay. So over here I've got just a few props that we're gonna use for baby Luca and I'll tell you guys how we're gonna use each one once we get started but first I'm going to get the star of the show ready dressed and in his outfit here he is can you say hi baby Luca hi so I definitely waited until after his nap to try any of this and I'm on his time today so whenever he wants to eat we eat whenever he wants to chill we chill whenever he wants to stop taking pictures we're gonna stop taking pictures and we're gonna cuddle I'm just gonna go off what he needs today because he's actually doing me a favor by being the most perfect model but let's waste no more time let's get right into it so he's changed I haven't put his hat on him yet because I, he's not too fond of hats so the less time he spends in it the better so I'm gonna wait till the very last minute we're gonna use candy canes for a prop I think I'm only gonna use the green ones I'm just gonna sc scatter them all around him and then I also just got a white blanket to lay him on um, it's actually a Janice Joplin blanket but the underside of it it's white so it worked so let's get started is from an amazing place Starbucks um, if you guys have not tried their snowman cookies they're not only delicious they're adorable I'm gonna show you guys how we're gonna do a really cool photo with this run don't walk to Starbucks get this cookie and do a Christmas photo with your baby it is super cute and delicious and I get to take a bite out of the head for the photo mm. let's go Snowman is done. We're gonna move on to something super simple, super easy. If you guys can see, it is, he's back there talking. Um, it is The Grinch So Christmas, my favorite book. Let's use it. All right, guys, we are ready to roll. I'm just gonna put The Grinch over him and shoot. You ready, Lou? You ready? Let's go. We're gonna take a break for a minute. Like I said, get some cuddle time in. Um, Honestly, the hardest part about doing this uh, DIY photos myself is squatting down so much to take a picture of him. Like, my legs <laughs> hurt so bad that I need the break more than he does, to be honest, because the longer I sit and the longer I have been down, I'm not sure if I'm gonna make it. And I think we still have like one or two more props left in my legs. He's, he's cool now, he's, he's fine, it's mommy, it's mommy who needs help. But I figured out that with um, baby photos, it's a lot of like adjusting and taking photos really quick. Adjust the hat, hurry, take a picture before he moves. Adjust the book because he kept kicking the book off. That was my biggest problem. But so far, I think that would be the only um, two or three things that I've taken away from this is, girl, you need to squat more. Two, 
just quickly and three snap your picks quickly and lots of breaks so that's four isn't it totally four but I think he's had a long enough break let's get back to it I'm actually going to set him on his little boppy I covered it with his blankie and I put the lights just loosely around him and I put him up next to the present so that'd be a pretty backdrop and we're gonna try it this way after he takes a passy break right Lou So we have almost made it through. We are on our last photo. Last thing I needed was just a lone little ornament. He is taking a break with his um, favorite teether. Mom must check out Mom Bella if you have a tiny baby who is already teething. He loves his. So um, after he gets a little break, we're on our last photo. I'm super excited to see how these turn out. So. Let's finish it up. Let's go. So I've got them all set up. I'm going to shoot at a downward angle from the ornament. If that doesn't work, I'm just going to shoot some shots of him with the ornaments around him. So easy. Hopefully I can get this teether away from him. We'll see. So while I was cleaning up all of our photo props, somebody fell asleep under the Christmas tree. He literally fell asleep under the Christmas tree and it's the sweetest thing. He's snoring and everything. Let me show you. I don't know if I've seen anything cuter than a baby asleep under a Christmas tree. Like this is top notch. So I'm taking this opportunity to get a photo of him really quickly to remember this moment. My baby <laughs> falling asleep under his first Christmas tree. Oh my gosh. Y'all, this mama heart's about to melt. I can't, I can't. So for this photo, I just strategically placed some photos around him, some bright red ones. And then I put some little green ornaments around him. And these are probably gonna be the easiest to take. Because he's asleep, he's not gonna be fussing. I'm not gonna have to constantly pick stuff up that he's kicking off of him. So um, this is gonna work out great. And I'm super excited to see how they turn out. Let's go. So I'm so glad that he fell asleep because there were some photos that I really wanted to get today that just didn't work out. And I think it's okay to just say, okay, this isn't going to work out. It's a baby. So you have to understand that not everything's going to go to plan. So some of the photos with the lights and some of the other ideas I had didn't go exactly as planned, but then a lot of the other ones went perfect. And then we had little perfect moments that just popped up, like him falling asleep under the Christmas tree, which wound up being my absolute favorite pictures. But guys, thank you for sticking around for another video. Thank you for watching another vlog episode with the Rob Squad. Um, if you liked it, give us a big thumbs up, help us out. And you have a goal before you go, which is to make somebody smile. And we'll see you guys later.